Good morning, dogs. Bake broadcast, FAFSA, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Seniors, there will be a third event coming up next week for FAFSA and Completion Night. It will be held at the Purdue Extension Office around the 21st of February. Please see Mrs. Wirtz and Student Services if you need a list of documents. Next, we have a huge big broadcast coming up on the 23rd and 25th of February. It starts at 7 p.m., so bring your friends and family over to come watch the show and see their hidden talents. Now, to sports and weather. What's up, dogs? Tonight, the swim team travels to Zionsville to compete in sectionals. May begins at 5.30. Best of luck to our swimmers. Tomorrow, the basketball team travels to Southmont to face off against the Mounties in a conference matchup. The game will begin at 6 with a JV start and a varsity follow. That's all for sports, and I'll send it to your weatherman. Thanks, Nelson. For the weather today, there's a high of 49 and a low of 24. There's supposed to be scattered showers from now to 3 o'clock, with thunderstorms at 10 a.m. But that's all for your weather today, dogs. Now back to your hosts. Thanks, Holden. Also, seniors, are you planning to pursue a career in teaching? If so, please take advantage of the Retired Teachers of Clinton County Scholarship. But hurry, because the deadline is coming up on March 1st. Please see Ms. Swartz on Student Services for this and other scholarship applications. For lunch today, in lines 1 and 2 is country fried steak, and in lines 3 and 4 is Nashville hot chicken with mac and cheese. A special happy birthday goes out to Emmanuel Morales and Melanie Sandoval Mejia. And that's it for today's announcement. Make sure to like and subscribe. Have a good day, dogs.